Good morning, European fans of Privateer FX. Federal Reserve raised rates and raised guidance as expected. Stocks did not like it. Choppy, but in the end, lower. S&P less choppy. Fall so low. NASDAQ was quite a bit more choppy. But we printed outside range in S&Ps, so our patience waiting for 78.10 uh, has now been accelerated to less patient. We are sellers today. Um, ECB obviously today throws a little bit of muck in the rock, but it looks like 27.85. 27.95 uh, are good entry points for sales in the S&Ps. We don't break trade S&Ps. It's too deep and stocks aren't really uh, as fear driven with the VIX here as, as uh, we would like. So it's more of a, a, a quiet fade in the S&Ps today. Let's take a look at cable. Pretty darn bullish bar there with a doji close. We've already printed a new daily high. We've got UK retail sales today. Uh, not sure where the where the place to get long is, but it's it's somewhere. Just gonna have to see how this prints and where it goes today. Uh, no tr no no specific trade idea yet, but. We like being long pounds. Euro, we're not going to touch before ECB. 118.40 is going to be important today after failing through that low at 117.30 last night. Dollar Swiss. Wow. Just, just can't go up too well. Gotta say. Patiently waiting at uh, 99.01. No trade yesterday for FOMC, where I was darn sure this thing was going to pop. I don't know, no Swiss. I mean, I do know, just avoid it. It's confusing as all hell. But that was some pretty bearish price action, considering the U.S. raises rates and euros on its knees. Dollar Swiss cannot make the new high weird. Dollar yen, we like it lower today. Uh, we will, we are short. Uh, we will be adding aggressively to dollar yen shorts. The 200 day has been eclipsed at 18 again. Um, might have to sell some while we're talking today. 07 given. Uh, through the figure, maybe. Um, we are short dollar yen today. This um, this is a trade that uh, that we are on. See, yesterday we made that big tail, closed at the lows. Stocks are offered. We like dollar yen lower. Euro yen, slightly different story because of the ECB. We are not going to touch Aussie yen. Aussie. Employment was worse last night, so Aussie Yen should also go lower today. A little bit late to the game, and the chart's not beautiful, so not really too sure what to do with Aussie Yen. You could sell high ones if this is uh, if this is the horse you want to ride today, but uh, we're going to stick with Dollar Yen. Sterling Yen, it's just kind of an interesting chart. Could go either way. Um, UK retail sales are going to sort of decide the fate of this, and but no trade. So basically we're selling S&Ps today and we are short dollar yen. Good luck people. Talk to you at the New York Open for a little pre-ECB preview. Ciao.